So last time I updated my Dr. Squiggles project, I had just made these wooden organ pipe boxes, but I didn't really have any organ pipes, or I just had some kind of crappy prototype organ pipes. And so now I just spent a whole month sitting next to the 3D printer printing all of these organ pipes, and I'm finally done with that, and I've got them all tuned and everything, so I'm very happy about that. And the way this works is that underneath the table here, I showed this before, but this is the air supply for the organ. It's just a fan and a soundproof box. And then the air comes up through these black uh, pipes here and goes into each organ. And then each Dr. Squiggles basically can just turn its own eight pipes on and off. And then over here, I set up this keyboard uh, and so I have the keyboard connected to my computer in such a way that every time I press a note on the keyboard, my computer receives that and kind of broadcasts it out over the Wi-Fi network. So like if I press middle C, my computer kind of says, hey, is there anybody that knows how to play middle C? And then if any of the robots actually have that note, then that robot will play the note. And so I made 24 organ pipes, so I've got two octaves starting at this E down here and then ending actually at this E flat up here. Since all the notes are going through my laptop, I don't really need the keyboard. I can just program a sequence of notes into my computer and then play that back. <clears throat> As you can hear, there are tons of weird little timing issues and stuck notes and dropped notes, but I'm not that concerned about it. I'm not going to spend that much time debugging it because I know that those are the result of the Wi-Fi because I'm sending messages from my computer to the robots over the network and yeah, there, there's packet loss and things like that. Um, and the reason I'm not concerned about it is because ultimately the setup that I'm using is kind of tangential. The point of building these isn't to be able to control them with a keyboard. The point is to have them eventually be completely autonomous. 
So I want each robot to be listening to whatever is going on in the room and kind of making it up its own music and responding to whatever it hears. Um, and that setup won't require any Wi-Fi or anything like that because the robot can just directly play its own notes. But yeah, so this is what I'm going to be working on in the coming, I don't know, month or two maybe trying to set up, basically just trying to make these robots fully autonomous. But anyway, yeah, I think that's all for now, and I'll see you next time. Bye!